Back on Umbriel, the IGC attempted to transport Trader and CFI leader known as Rabbit to a new black site. At the same time, CFI had made an alliance with the Crypto Kings and Aphasius groups to fight against the IGC. During the conflict, many of them were taken prisoner, and some shared a cell with Rabbit himself. This would later result in a well-planned and well-executed escape in the night. CFI would once again be reunited with their leader. The IGC was defeated, their numbers largely diminished, and in a fit of rage, they burned Kage to the ground, leaving many to question their morals and whether the council could protect them. Rebel groups began forming. People were forced to pick a side. Soul System News Network agreed to follow IGC into one of the deadliest wars the Soul System had seen. The Marines were getting ready for transport, and after a quick briefing, my news partner went to follow one squad while I departed via dropship with the Marines. Let's go kick their ass! Whoa! Get in! Oh my gosh! Oh, I'm running so fast. The IGC was once again roaring in numbers. Young engineers, young scientists, people's sons and daughters joined the fight. Reaper 2, y'all good? Yes, sir. 2-1. Off at the um, I IGC drop-off location and took heavy fire from CFI. I think we're just going to follow them to figure out what the plan is. Trying to get by. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. Oh my god. Soul System News Network almost barely survived the night. After finding a place to make camp, we get a message from one of our sources. Journal record log number 9391. After recent deployment, my stance on CFI has changed. While they seem determined and organized, in the background, I think that's different. Baby's group and Crypto Kings are working with them as well, though I don't sense that lasting long either. It's in my view all three are using each other to further their own agendas. I can say in my view, this is going to be a long war. I literally just asked where the hell you guys were. A group of the IGC were stationed in this house overnight. After speaking to Commander Connolly, he agrees to let us in to interview some of his men. I'm with Dagger One. We were coming up all the way on the highway up there. We dropped in, got stuck by this checkpoint, and then I came over the barbed wire, got got hit, but I got TQ'd, and we were coming over here, and there was like six guys in here, I think. You're, you're okay. And it was just grenade after grenade after grenade, and 
It was wild. Never experienced anything like this before. Seven total, six hostage. Dang. I held one at Spoon Point. Were you able to get any information from them? Um, I'm not sure. You'd probably have to ask, uh, Skivs. What was it? Huh? What any information it? from the hostages? Uh... That would you got anything out of that, That'd be a question no. for Doc. The Soul Wars was initially seen as a just war. The CFI was seen as a rebellious group, and they were. But after the burning of Kage and unjustified captures and killings, the IGC seems to be straying from their core principles. One minute to talk to us. I think I could. We kind of rolled train on CFI, thankfully. Put up much of a fight this time. Unfortunately, our platoon commander GQ was just captured. Oh. So. Okay. Is that him over there? Yes, it is. He was the driver. Can I search your body? Uh, We've searched him. Wasting my time. <laughs> oh, oh, you set an example. Set an example. Oh, this good you this is what they deserve. <laughs> this is what they deserve. Is the platoon commander? Honestly, I don't know. He didn't give us any intel, so we have no idea. Um, as per the CFI guy that walked past, I believe it was their commander. Their, their platoon commander, at least. Well, we killed him. <laughs> oh, we, we didn't kill him. We were second. Sorry, can you repeat backup. that? We're just trying to maintain peace and order. And they come in. They just tear it up. See what they're doing here? Backwater planet. What's the purpose? Nothing, but they're just terrorizing it. We're gonna fight. We're gonna win. Soul System News Network was hired by the IGC to present the war in a way that would favor them. But after everything we had seen, <laughs> we were finding it difficult to justify their actions. I started recording a segment when I heard my name being called from behind me. That kind of shows you uh, how much they really give a fuck about you, doesn't it? Because I gave them a thumbs up, and like, that's me. Like, they're not taking care of you. They just let you walk up to me. Mm -hmm. What was the anything. turning point for you to leave them? I mean, you were high up in command. So talk, talk to him. We know what he's doing. We know what he's all about. We know what they want. It's a fucking lie. And what's your plan? Survive. It's everybody's plan, isn't it? We were asked to drive through CFI territory to bring supplies to a squad of IGC stationed on the border of the Galahad. But when we returned, the IGC had already begun their attack. Move forward, move forward, move forward now, move forward now, if you gotta move it, move now! I'm too fast for your suckers. All wars need a hero, yet today we have none. Only time will tell what the future holds for the soul system. What I am sure of is that it is vital for our security that we continue to stand together.
You, Doc, this message is for you. You will burn for what you did to our village. You will pay for what you've done to all these people. And we will not stop until the day you stop breathing.